It's only a failure if you stop, otherwise it's just a step towards success. A Montrealer shattered expectations and claimed the Guinness World Record for... The deepest underwater modeling photo shoot, this is Kim Bruno's story. On that day when we woke up, the ocean was the nicest I've ever seen it. These photos taken in the Bahamas. The previous record holders went down 98 feet into Georgian Bay and Lake Huron in, yep, our very own Ontario, Canada in September. But on December 5th, Bruno broke the record, modeling at 130 feet. You feel like you're part of the animals. It feels like you're part with the fish and the rays and the dolphins and the jacks and all these beautiful creatures I swam with. And I thought it was very artistic and it was calming. It's the only way that I could relax in my fertility treatments. Her pregnancy journey is what led her to discover her passion for the underwater world. After unsuccessful fertility treatments in Montreal, she made her way to Mexico, then Florida, seeking other solutions. I said, while I'm there, I'm going to pursue my studies and become a master diver. And since it's the shark capital of the world, why not? become a shark conservationist and then through Instagram was pushing me you know with the algorithms more diving stuff and I discovered underwater photography so I hit up Pia the photographer on Instagram and I said you want to meet up when I'm not at the clinic I'd love to try and it was an instant hit. We are now here at the Leonardo da Vinci Center pool in St. Leonard and you're going to show me how to pose underwater. Now when you do this in the ocean of course you have your team and it's safe but for here today I'm with you so you're a professional I'm good but you at home don't try this at home but instead you can laugh at me as I try this okay. <laughs> so when you practice first you want to practice with a mask so the mask is going to help you see underwater. Free diving is about meditation, basically. So it's about relaxing yourself and being comfortable underwater. So for us, when we do photo shoots, we have a belt, uh, which we attach weight to that keep us down. Submerging herself was a way to relieve stress after a miscarriage and further fertility treatments. And then I finally got pregnant. So my miracle happened. A gift from the ocean, she says, Ella Rose, born in January 2023. I thought that was it for me. I thought I was hanging my fins for good that way until somebody sent me the record, right? And everything in life is about choices and opportunity and just going ahead. So I did. In Montreal, Pamela Pagano, City News.